An 80 foot tall oil derrick is tilting toward power lines in Huntington Beach and forcing the evacuation of nearby homes and apartments. Eyewitness News Orange County Bureau Chief Eileen Frayer is live at the scene with the very latest. Eileen. And David, the oil derrick, which is the white structure that you see behind me, kind of leaning to the right there, there were workers on that doing routine maintenance on the oil wells that are right next to it. All of a sudden, it started leaning. One resident we talked to said it sounded like a, a loud cracking sound. It started leaning toward the house right next to it. That's been evacuated. And, and as well as an apartment complex uh, right next to us here, part of that complex has also been evacuated just as a precaution. Now, joining me is Captain Bob. Bob Colhane with the Huntington Beach Fire Department. And any idea what caused this to suddenly start leaning? We don't know what exactly caused it. They were pulling the rods out of the well at the time. So they have cables that go from the very top of the derrick all the way down to the rods. As they pull them out in 30 foot sections, something happened where there's enough stress to pull it over and the derrick began to fail. We don't know if the rods got stuck or if it was just a failure of the structure. We're going to have to wait until we actually take it apart, examine it, and then figure out what's happening. So it started leaning, and, it, and it's not only leaning toward the house and part of this apartment building, but also power lines. Uh, there's power lines that run just adjacent to the property on one side. We've got the house just on the other. And our concern is as it buckles, it's not designed to do that, so it could swing one way or the other. Um, so, yeah, exactly. We, we're, we're, and then the reason we're worried about the apartments across the street is in case it throws any debris. So we evacuated the 10 apartments that face the derrick. And the power has been shut off at this point? Power has been shut off to about 25 homes at this time, yes. Okay. And so obviously an investigation is going to take place here. Any idea uh, for people who live in the area when they can get back in? Uh, you know, they were able to shut off the power and confirm that it's shut off. They're now able to start doing some work on the derrick. Um, it's going to be a guess on my part, but within an hour or two, we should have the power back up. Once we have that derrick stabilized and we have it deconstructed to the point where it's not going to endanger anybody, we can let people back into their homes. Okay, thanks so much, Captain. And again, uh, fortunately, no injuries with this. And again, they'll be working uh, for a little while here trying to dismantle it to make sure everything's safe. Reporting live from Huntington Beach, Eileen Freyer, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Thank you.